I've got a great place to show you today. This is the newest development in Woodbury, a Michael Lee designed home. This is the Adams build, extremely livable and quite affordable. Let's check it out. Hello friends and welcome to 5026 Air Lake Draw here in Woodbury. This is a new build home by Michael Lee in partnership with Kootenia Homes. And this home is a great value for a new build in Woodbury. And right as you enter the home, one thing I love is that you have this great entryway, but it leads right into this light filled living room, open concept down there. But right here, great little office space facing the front, facing the porch absolutely love what's going on out there and then as we come back toward this living room you have stairs up here this is a four bedroom three bathroom three car garage 2400 finished square feet above grade and another thousand plus square footage below and look how great this space is again this is new build in woodbury a much more affordable option than you might think i think my personal favorite thing about this home about this model is all the windows all the light that comes in especially in this main floor space i love the sliding glass door that goes out to what would be a deck and that window above the kitchen is i think one of my favorite moments in the house but this kitchen let's talk about it a really great a nice design to this kitchen extremely usable you've got this great island seats four easy and i love the wraparound design that's what you're seeing everywhere we actually just did one of these tours for a two plus million dollar house and beautiful by the way but it had the same exact fundamental shape which is sort of an l with an island that opens up to the rest of the space. It's an extremely livable layout. I think you'll see this over and over again in houses. But check out this window. I love this. I especially imagine this home being built on a lot where maybe this looks out to a more scenic area or something like that. This is the backyard and such a great spot to hang, to cook, to do dishes, whatever it is. I just think this is such a, a smart design element that adds a lot of value to this house. I also really like the backsplash here, kind of a denim navy color. Ah, such a cool choice. In this house, you've got a really great appliance pack. It's this nice stainless steel hood vent. I like how the tile goes all the way up. I just think it's a nice eye-catching feature from across the room. A great drop-in Samsung gas burner and then Samsung finishes out the appliance set with a great side-by-side -side bottom freezer and a double oven situation which is a, a microwave convection up top and then the oven below which I have to say I really love the look of this rather than just a microwave sitting somewhere alone I like that it gives a double oven look which is kind of classy elegant elevated well, it's really a convection microwave. You've got a very substantial size pantry, big fan of that. I know a lot of people in this market are looking for pantries, not just a single cabinet. A couple last thoughts on this kitchen. I like the light fixtures. I like the minimal design of the countertops and the very sleek, very minimal cabinet poles. I think it's just a really good choice. Right over here, this is sort of the main entryway, living day-to-day -day life. This is how you're gonna enter most of the time. Right out here, three car garage, and it's a good size three car garage. In fact, the third stall is a little bit extended. I've been seeing a surprising amount of new builds where something like a half ton pickup won't even fit in the garage lengthwise, but for sure you're good in this house. I bet even a, a bigger pickup, maybe even a boat could fit in that third stall. Pretty easy peasy. Really great half bath right here. And again, right from the garage, right from the drop area, have your main living space kitchen that's such a, a good design for modern day living we open up here to the living room I really like this living room it's again fairly minimal huge windows tons of light coming in I really really appreciate that nice tall ceilings here I appreciate the beams a cool architectural moment in what is otherwise a fairly minimal design. And in keeping with that minimal design, I really like this fireplace around, nice sleek tiles, and the fact that this wood, very minimal again, but matches the beams up top, a good choice. And then in a very livable fashion, you have the stairs that go up, stairs that go down. This goes down to a fully unfinished basement. Again, another thousand plus square footage of space waiting to be finished. Let's go upstairs.
Another thing that I've been appreciating in some new builds, you don't see it in everything, but you see it in some of the new builds, is the window in the stairway. And these great big stairways that feel pretty grand, but without the window, it feels almost commercial. It feels like you went into the side door of a hotel and you have to figure out where your room is from there. Right here, this is the primary suite. This room is great. Really, really good size. Got the nice vaulted ceiling the great windows that look into the backyard and they're double hung Pella windows, which Pella makes a great window and the double hung easy to clean option. I love that on the second floor, especially you don't have to go outside. You can just wipe it down there, latch it up, drop it back down and you're good to go. This bedroom is a great size, king size bed, easy, two headstands, easy, and a bunch of accoutrement to fill out the space. And then you go in here, we have the primary ensuite bath. You have a substantially sized double vanity here with Moen fixtures. And I really like the wood tone that they chose on this. Nice little addition to this otherwise very crisp, very clean feeling bathroom. And probably my favorite part is actually these windows, sort of a transom style window, let in a lot of light, but leave you with a lot of privacy. I really appreciate the width of both the shower and the side fill jacuzzi tub, and just a good length on the shower space as well. And then of course, the walk-in closet, you gotta have it. It's the primary suite. And then coming out of this primary bedroom, it's four bedroom, two bathroom upstairs. You got three very good size, substantial rooms. Bedroom number two and bedroom number three, face the front, they're separated by the laundry room. Love a second floor, love a domicile floor laundry room. I think it's a, whoever decided to do that first and put it into new builds, very good idea. And again, great light coming in through those Pella double hung windows, which are in all of the bedrooms. Bathroom number three, a great just main floor community bathroom with a full tub shower combo. And now we're in bedroom number four, Great space here. All of the bedrooms have a walk-in closet. Obviously the primary has an even bigger walk-in closet. All right, let's go inside. And I think by the time the end buyer of this home finishes out this backyard, puts a deck on, maybe fences it, something like that, this will be such an extremely livable house. I think this style of floor plan is quickly becoming a classic modern style floor plan because it's just so usable. The laundry upstairs, the three car garage, the open living space, I really believe that that is just what the future of so many homes are gonna look like. I think you'll agree that it's one of the better values for a new built home in Woodbury. And if you wanna watch more videos like this, check out this playlist right here. And as always, if you haven't done so yet, subscribe to the channel right here and we'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.